the nation grapples with the toll that this virus is taking, there is a promising weapon in the fight against COVID-19. It's called convalescent plasma. The Red Cross has begun testing for antibodies during routine blood donations. The positive donors can then donate convalescent plasma. News Tracy Tracy Carlis with the story of those giving of themselves to help others. Ron Baumberger volunteers at the American Red Cross preparing emergency response vehicles to respond to emergencies. But Ron is also helping those fighting COVID-19. He recovered from it and donated his plasma. I found out that my plasma was used with somebody in Beckley, West Virginia. So it's, it's great that, you know, if, 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 if there's, you know, some way we can help people to do that, to recover from that, that may have a worse case than we do. Months before Ron got COVID, his wife was ill in January, long before doctors knew COVID-19 was in Northeast Ohio. She donated blood and discovered she too has the antibodies and plans to donate plasma too. I think she was relieved that she figured out that she had it. In mid-June, the American Red Cross started testing all blood, platelets, and plasma donations for COVID-19 antibodies. If you maybe were sick and you don't know, did I have it, did I not have it, this blood, by donating blood, you'll get that antibody result. You'll know for sure, and then you might be able to give convalescent plasma. As of last month, here in Ohio, there have been 692 convalescent plasma donors. The Red Cross has collected 1,579 units. Doctors are using the convalescent plasma to treat those fighting COVID-19 and have seen some success. Michelle Wolosnik is on the front lines of this pandemic. I work at the Cleveland Clinic and I took care of COVID patients. She is a nurse and got COVID in June, donated blood a month later and discovered she had the antibodies. Now, today, for the first time, Michelle gave plasma. I give blood and plasma and platelets in the hospital to my patients, and I know how important it is. Um, so I wanted to help others, especially those who have COVID, you know, help them recover. If you donate blood or plasma, the American Red Cross now has an app that lets you know where your donation has been sent. In Cleveland, Tracy Carlos, News 5.